What a winning smile. Let's come on back. So this is finally, after many, many months of waiting, a video uh, about Chewie's visit up here. He finally got to come up. He only got to spend a day, but um, we packed a lot in that day. And the very first thing we had to do was take him fishing on the lake. That's when I realized my gut was in the camera, so I ran away. Anyways, so Chewie's um, fishing. He was the only one that caught fish because he is a master fisherman. Then, of course, he took the helm of the Argo. Uh, this is his first time driving an Argo. He realized how difficult it was at first, but here is him just being a boss and tackling what we call big rock. It's essentially a big, muddy rock. Man, does he ever look like the boss right there. Tough guy. And this is where Chewie learns how aggravating an old Argo can be. I mean, it does us well, but it's not without its constant quirks. So here it slipped out of gear on him. And what I love most about this clip is he moves forward a little bit, it slips out of gear again, and then he gives the face. And it's one of the best faces. <laughs> just because it shows our little Chewy next to the big Chewy and it's just adorable to me. This is great because it's showing Sammy uh, directing on how to drive this. To get through this trail you have to know where to put your wheels and how to get there and Sammy's just showing off her knowledge of the track and helping give uh, Chewy direction on how to make it through uh, some pretty gnarly spots. It's uh, kind of a cool moment to see her do that. I think Sammy just looks adorable here. Oh, whoa, 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 we gotta go that way. So that's the bit, that's the wheel square to it so you pop up on top. Otherwise you're just gonna push it out and you'll never make it. So you go forward a little bit, turn sharp. Hit this, turn sharp again, and away you go. I'm gonna go onto the property because I think you guys are set from here. Okay. <laughs> There's my property. Yeah. So here's Chewy being a big boss man again, handling a really difficult section. Sammy, of course, giving all the guidance necessary to make it through. Well, that's that side. Let's get a little this way. Oh. Okay. So we're going to go forward and walk this side. Go that way. There you go. Forward, go forward.
passes that sign, he's on the road. So what do you think of your Argo drive? It's exhausting. <laughs> <laughs> and you didn't have to get out and pull or winch or anything. Mentally exhausting. Yeah. And challenging. And it's a dexterity thing too, right? So of course I had to take Chewie on a little tour of the homestead as much as we could get into in a short period of time. Starting here at the garden. We do, that's my rhubarb. We brought it up in the plant today and it stayed. Can you believe that? I can't believe it. Do you have anything else planted? Uh, corn right there. But we don't know if it's coming up yet because it's still too young. I probably should be back here in my truck, but not here. Well, up here is another rock. So really what happens is this rock goes down. And there's a little valley, but it goes right up again. And up that hill is eventually where I'm building my house. Okay. This rock goes all the way down to Pops' rock. This is actually Pops' rock. Oh no, sorry, Argo rock. Sorry. Then, this goes up there to the big rock at the end of the property. So, over this way. So this is where I'm walking Chewy up to the big valley that I found on my property. And it's a big deal for me and I like that Chewy uh, makes it feel like a big deal. Right. Which is you know, why I love Chewy. Wow. And uh, see, these trees are massive. Because they go down another 25 feet. And then they go up and there's all the ones on top of the hill. Interim? I don't eat them. It's about a quarter of the way And this the is hill. where Chewy learns that I have a yeah. sad obsession with trees, Beautiful and especially tree. old big trees on my property. I kind of want to take that down um, a couple he indulges of me over the other because, side um, and use that to make He's just a great guy and I'm obsessed oh, with trees. Yeah, Right there, straight up. Yeah. That's a monster. And it's cedar. Oh, careful, this stuff gives way. This is the other way down. Oh, What's okay. fun is we didn't know we had company on the way, and my neighbors fed and, and Brad from the road. Is just a gorgeous wonderland down there. Untouched. Woo! So, yeah! Got out of that, thank God. So, so. So my, uh, I will never complain about my life ever, 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 ever again. That's gnarly, that's gnarly. Eh? Holy Christ. What's funny is it gets worse down there. Down. Hey, what's enough? Yeah. So this is Chewy, come on, Chewy. His name's Chewy. Peter, but we call him Chewy. Chewy, this is Brad nice to meet you, buddy. Fred. Fred. Look. So of course the new guests, I start giving a tour to everybody. Um, sadly, my first stop was to find out hey. one of my favorite big trees had yeah. ants and uh, need to cut it down before they destroyed the wood, or the lumber, I should say. Back here, Obi-Wan. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We can bring four bricks at a time. We have the Argo, and the Argo can make it up to down there. Where we uh, just, the lower? Yeah. Because we pulled logs from right there. Those two there used to be four. So here we had to run out and move about. Seems like we spent a lot of time on the Argo, and the truth of the matter is we did. And here is uh, Chewy going down Pops' rock. Pops' rock never looks, you know, steep or, or bad in videos. Uh, this is the first time Chewie went down it and he told me it uh, 
felt like a roller coaster it was so steep. I like this clip because it just shows Sammy is such a boss lady when it comes to driving that Argo. That's through G pole and it is a bad section, but she just monster it. And here, of course, I'm being my typical a-hole self, and I forced Chewie to drive down Pops' rock on his own in the Argo. Well, not his own. I was with him. So if we crashed, we were going good. But, um... I think it's an experience that everyone should uh, should enjoy. I'm explaining to Chewie that you're best to put one foot forward. Because we're so tall, it's really hard to keep our feet anywhere but tucked behind us. But going down the rock, it's tricky in the Argo because you need to brake and slow down, which means you're pulling the things you're holding onto towards yourself as your whole body just wants to fall forward into the Argo. So uh, it's, it's a little awkward and I find bracing your knee or your your foot up against the firewall just keeps you in place for it but uh, it's a fun experience taking down that rock These quirky moments are why I love hanging out with Chewie, because we just, we'll just do random weird things, and uh, it makes me laugh every time. <laughs> well, good sir, how was your sleep? Good. How was the camper of love? Not so much love. Aww. It's a diabetic stream, Donut. Because the only way they'd be able to consume it is in a dream. <laughs>